well if it makes you feel better. The uh, Chidake told me the father was dead, so... I don't know. And I asked him if they at least stabbed him in, you know, an artery like the femoral or carotive, but uh, apparently they didn't, so hopefully the job got done. The next day, I returned to Zeb Castle to meet with Brother Lul. Just like Brother Liam, he also had many questions. Well, I have a question for you, brother. Yeah. Why did they let you go? They also let Sterling go. And last night, they let everyone else go as well. Except for one man, I'm telling you. I'm not working with anybody. I understand your weariness, and that's completely justifiable. But uh, there's nothing else I can say. You can either not trust me or trust me. There's nothing else I can do. I'm already fucked up enough as it is with being pulled away with guns to my head and fucking tied up all the time and I'm starting to quite frankly get sick of it. So, Brother Lou, all I can say to you is that I am not working with them. The worst I've done is give them names. Some of our names, they forced me, I was bleeding to death, can you blame me? There's nothing else I can do. It was either I die, or I give up some measly, uh, useless names. What's the names really have to do with it? So that is my side of the story. Did you give them my name? Didn't really pop in my head at first. I just wanted to ask you. Do I need to be looking up over my shoulder? Yeah, yeah, you do. Yeah, you gotta look over your shoulder all the time. I also have to look over my shoulder all the time, and I'm quite frankly getting sick of it. There's no, I can't promise you anything. You could have two choices here. You could either abandon me like every fucking buddy, or you could believe me. What do you want me to do? Leave or stay with you? I don't want to leave, brother. I don't want to leave, but I don't know what to say for you and everybody else to believe me. They took me. They held me hostage. They made me fucking suffer, and I would have expected my brothers and sisters to have my back. But it appears that I don't have that, and yet again, I am left alone to deal with all this shit. I know Brother Liam is on my case, and I'm tired of it trying to explain to him the same I'm explaining to you. But what do you want me to say? Look over your shoulder all the time, Brother Lou. Yes, because if you don't, you might die. This is the apocalypse, after all, is it not? I mean, if it's not them, it's the biters. If it's not the biters, then it's a fucking desperate guy that wants your gun or your food. Always look over your shoulder. I can't promise you safety all the time. I can only promise to help you if I can. I understand, brother. Regardless that the Maker is there or not, regardless that the Father is dead or not, we still got each other and that's all I have. And I'm willing to do anything to keep that. I didn't know that people wanted us dead. This was all such new information for me. I didn't, I had no idea. Later on, I contacted Brother Liam so he could meet me in Dolina and we could set things straight. He was on his way with a man he met called Chief. Well, um, in regards to how I came to be with these people, uh, that's, uh, not sure if I actually explained that to you before, but, um, I was searching for the Detective Mikhail well as my sister, neither of which have I found. Hopefully the people of uh, Dolina might be able to assist me. I know a number of people pass through there and I've spoken with um, Alyssa. She assured me uh, if anybody's heard of my sister that she'll try to let me know. Hopefully, uh, hopefully somebody has. As they kept going towards Dolina, they got into a pretty heated situation. Alright, you live. You can lower the hands, you're gonna get to a steady jog, you're gonna follow me. You understand that? Both of you let's fucking go. Liam happened to be at the wrong place at the wrong time. 
You know, I'd have a lot more respect for you if you'd be honest with me. I don't need your fucking respect. And what was it? Your respect is nothing but cancer to me. Alright, yeah. <clears throat> Could the Axel fella, or chief, whatever the fuck y'all call him, speak up now? Yeah. What do you want? I think I met you before a lot in that town of Mista, yeah. I did. Now uh, you remember that Slade fella and that Ivan fella were calling them dogs and such. Yeah, I remember who you are. After we put down Slade or whatever and took Ivan hostage on our way out, we took a shot, one of my lads took a shot right to the back. I don't know where it came from or who did it, but we had an outside source go into your town and ask some questions. After finding out his name was Leeway, our other outside source found out he was part of your organization. Is this correct information I'm getting here, Mr. Chief? He is, but maybe he uh, did something prematurely if you take my The name. conversation went on all night. They finally resolved their issues. However, they figured out who Liam was. Well, I'm just telling you now that I... Anybody who is a part of your group, I can give you my word. And my word is solid. That you people won't I have any problems you. with them. Hi. So, Mr. Liam, do you affiliate yourself with any organizations? Or should I just hand you over to Kristoff here? <coughs> he can do the teachings of lessons. Well, I would uh, much rather prefer to not be bodily harmed, and I'd actually uh, have no fucking idea who... Uh, and your men are, so I can't really uh, say that I'd come after you. Mr. Liam it is, I like the name. Are you part of any organizations? Uh, uh, yes. Well, um, I was part of a uh, group of followers, you could say, of um, a uh, religion. Oh, no. Oh, oh no, bitch. lad. Are you telling me you're in those maker uh, the of the week, huh? Uh, Same well, from um, that Novi church that me and my lads used to siege every fucking day and put them in the dirt. See, I don't actually. actually uh, this one's uh, fucking yours. Do what you please. I don't actually know anything right, about that. We'll just give it a take. We can just take him and you know, take him uh, in the back. Uh, we'll take him to the corner no, right there. Give them the show. No, 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 don't touch him. We don't need to. We don't need to mentally scar them. Come on, they're just cool with us. Take him up to the back. No. I will take whatever uh, he's going to be given. He does no, all the right things. It's more fun for me. No, no, yeah? no. 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 I, I will take this is business that I will take his bird. Let me give you a history lesson. I will take his bird. I assure you, I'm no, 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 you do. not affiliated with whoever wronged you, and uh, quite frankly, I don't think I'm going to be involved with them much longer. As I was told, the father was murdered. So, uh, you know, then I'm told what to, you know, I've been, uh, Good morning. Good morning. While in Dolina, we met up with Reiner, previously known as Albert. Oh, well, well, look who it is. Don't touch you me. I'll broke him. It's just a hug. We can heal you. Yes, we can I don't need you. your healing. We can don't help you. He needs to be punished. He is a sinner. If you prefer. It was time for us to apologize. The fuck did I do to people? You know, some call me crazy, but have I ever hurt someone? At least not intentionally. I, 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 I don't kill people, regardless of these fucked up, messed up times. I'm not looking to fuck it up worse than it already is. I'm not a bad guy, I really am not. I really hope you'll forgive me, Mr. I, I don't even know your name, Albert or something. Imagine. Well, I don't know you well enough. He said his name was Albert, Albert or Reiner. Name. Doesn't matter to me. I, I, I hope in time you will learn to forgive me and, and, and us for doing what we did to you. I genuinely feel bad. I'm glad to hear that you were normal people merely manipulated rather than psychopath. It's confusing, Reiner. I don't know now what to believe. You see, it's, 
It's I want to believe in the Maker, I, but I don't want to force people to this. If they're welcome to join, but it's, 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 to me, it's it, that's not what I signed up for. You see, all I wanted was was just to find peace and a family and people that take care of me. I need help. Ah! Ah! Oh, Liam, I don't, I don't think that there's going to be anything going to help the other Liam. <laughs> I guess you're a bit hard at hearing, yeah? <laughs> I don't know why you're taking your vengeance out on me. I haven't done anything to you or your people, or anybody for that matter. Ah, Zuber found us down to... Oh, fuck it. I knew those people for maybe a week. I met the father maybe once or twice. I don't know what he's done to you or your people. He lied to me. That something I really don't care about, to be honest. Then out of nowhere, Carl showed up in Dolina. Uh, how are you, uh, Carl? He's come to kill you, Eddie. <laughs> I'm recovering. Uh, I guess Fuck you. Yeah. You're an idiot. Hmm. You're an idiot. Yes, an idiot. Uh, as am I. Huh. How, how is everyone else? To be honest, uh, I don't really know. The only other one that I've seen. Do it, you fucking weak shit. JT. But if it's any consolation, I haven't. Do it for me. I haven't hurt anyone or good old pal Quinn done anything wrong piece of shit he hasn't, he hasn't hurt anyone since I've known him do you guys want to speak in private you seem like you have some history <laughs> um, and, uh, obviously some catching up to do I get on your fucking feet Liam get on your fucking feet here fuck up Liam set up like a fucking man a piece of shit Okay. Alright, Lane, don't fuck him up. Let's fucking just let right. him fucking have it. Uh, Jesus fucking Patrick, lad. Up the wrong. Patrick, it's on the fucking wrong. Uh, Patrick, it's on the fucking wrong. You know, I didn't mean to hurt that night. I understand why you guys did what you did. Mm. I felt very mad. I felt very mm. sad. And then I understood why you did it. I forgave you. Because I had found something much bigger in my life. Yeah, and then that all turned out to be a, a lot of complications there too. I, I want to believe in the Maker, but I don't want to believe that the Maker wants to hurt people. I, I, I don't, I don't know, Carl. I'm very unstable right now. I'm not going to lie to you. I, I appreciate your honesty. I really do. Sometimes I lose control. But it seems like it's not making me black out anymore. Well, that's, that's getting better then, right? Sort of. This time I'm... It's like I'm trapped behind a window. And, and I can't get out and do anything about it. Um, it's hard to explain. There's another side of me that seems to come out, you know, the voices I hear I told you guys about that night. Uh, right. Well, he's taking over sometimes, but it doesn't seem like he wants to harm anybody. Uh, he seems like he wants to protect me, do things I can't do. All right, well, we got to get you some medical aid. Hopefully Mickey is here somewhere. We got to find yeah. him. Yeah. I'm feeling him. Little lightheaded. Hey! Hey! Hello! Those people. Somebody! Somebody! Please. They let Liam and the others go, but not without scarring him for life. They fucked up his nose, they ripped off his ear, they cut a finger and made him eat it. But luckily, he was still alive. Hey, I've got the guys. It's gonna lay here for a little bit, you know? Oh no, is that Liam? Oh no 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 no! What's what's wrong? We'll explain later. Just help him. Hurry, Man, Liam. I need you to turn your head. I need to see your fucking ear. Uh, I think we did it right. Liam, here. 
Just hold the bag and make sure. Just, just make sure you hold I've got, the bag. I'm gonna patch you up. It's gonna hurt a little. Don't bit. squeeze. Don't. Ow! Uh, no! 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 no. Uh, Tell me, all right. Fine. They got his nose, chief. They got his nose pretty good. Who did this to him? All right. Um, all right. Can I see Liam? Sure. Thank you. Eddie. He is your friend. Liam. They took a wrong turn at Polana. You didn't deserve this. I'm here for you, brother. Kristoff, uh -huh. I didn't si say anything about him. They said that I had to have a contract with the search. He's mm. gonna die. I can assure you that. Good. Yeah. Good, because if you don't do it, then I'm going to fucking mutilate this man for hurting my really good friend here. This man is like family to me. And he hurt him in an unimaginable way. And he needs to be dealt with. If he's going around doing this to other people, it's terrible. <laughs> Thank you so much for uh, helping uh, as best as you can and bringing him here and saving him. I am forever in your debt. Is Liam good to move? Can we move him somewhere? Liam, do you feel like you can move? <laughs> yeah. Uh, thank you for everything you've done for my friend. He was able to walk, but the morphine made him a little tipsy. Liam? I really appreciate it. Oh, uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, thank just you for remember, don't walk in the trees. You're gonna drop like a sack of potatoes in a couple hours. I'm gonna become a sack of potatoes? Yeah, Jesus fucking no, Christ. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> No, no, <laughs> calm down, brother. You okay? Uh, we'll, we'll take care of him. Uh, don't worry. It's been two weeks, and a lot has changed. With the father being dead, we're all very confused. Some of us still believe in the Maker, and, and some of us just don't. On the other hand, we still have each other. We all support and take care of each other. Brother, I just want you to know... Again, I will not persecute you for your thoughts or your beliefs. You can feel free to believe in the Maker. That is your choice. However, there are going to be brothers and sisters who might not be as understanding. Well, again, if the Father happens to be alive by some unfortunate miracle, that's going to make things a lot more complicated than they have to be. Yes. Right now, the people who despise us because of him have no real reason to, well, come after us anymore as long as he's dead. Correct. We can't very well follow a dead man. Hey, I don't know what to believe. I want to believe in the Maker. Just something doesn't feel quite right. So, I'm neutral right now. That's where I stand. That's perfectly fine, brother. Regardless of your choice, again, regardless of if we believe in the Maker, we have been together for some time. And just like with the other brothers and sisters, I consider you family. But brother, if, uh, if by some chance the Father, well, managed to survive and crawls out from wherever he's hiding one day, as unlikely as that seems, uh, we might have to uh, make sure that uh, history away. does not repeat itself. That's what I don't want. I was told the father was in a mental institution. I was told the father was insane. And he made up this belief, and whether or not he did, or whether or not he manipulated something that was real, the only thing that I may have an issue with is if the father were to come back and people decided to follow him once again, follow him on some very treacherous paths that would endanger all of my brothers and sisters, that would be problematic. I don't want anything to happen to you, Eddie. Hey, I don't want anything to happen to you. Caroline. Yeah. 
<sighs> I'm sick of this shit. A few days later, Liam and I met up with Caroline and Lou back in Dolina. The town seemed strangely more quiet than usual. There were a lot of hostilities there lately, and maybe they moved on. Uh, you, you, you guys don't need to worry. I, I'm going to be okay. But maybe... I feel maybe I should start looking for my medication. I, I don't know, maybe... I was a little concerned about my mental health. Mm. Well, Eddie, if you feel like this medicine will help you, if it will uh, use your mind, I think we can at least try to find it. I don't know if we will, but uh, yeah. it'll help you, brother. That's what I want. Sorry, Mr. Start... No, we're here for you, brother. It's, it's, it's quite a... I know. We just want to help. You have uh, more than you think. Good night, family. The next morning, I woke up a little late. The others were in town, and then I met these guys. You better walk away, homie. Yeah. Find me with your fist right now. Hey, do you mind following me here? Just a quick second. Oh, aren't you so Sure, but I got you friends uh, just behind these folks, okay, and huh? I need to see them. Okay. Yeah, you get to see them. Hey, Mr. Bean, get in here. Mr. Bean. You a tough guy, I say, huh? No, just go in here. Sure. You a tough guy, huh? Aren't you a fucking tough guy, aren't you? Hey, Mr. Bean! Mr. Bean, get in here! Mr. Time. Bean! You better not yeah, follow us anymore, Holmes. I'm gonna end up cutting you if you give me that finger one more time, Holmes. Well, that's not nice that he's doing that. Oh, uh, I don't know what's going on. You best get the fuck away from this building, Holmes. Fuck you! Idiot! He's uh, not alright out there or something? What's going on with him? Well, the thing is, they're gonna need to give us an apology. They were being kind of mean to my friend. Oh, well, that's not, not cool. We might end up shooting you, you know. get the fuck away from it. it didn't take too long. My family was surrounding the house. Yeah. Well, it doesn't You're matter. Being rude to to you. They suspect of me and shit. This man died. He hey, home, Baggy? I don't know if he's going to apologize. Oh, he's inside. He's inside, dude. What are you gonna do? What are you gonna do, home? I'm getting real tired of this shit. What are you gonna do, Oh, you gonna die, home? Then why are you coming to Uh, I don't know. I, uh... Is that these guys say uh, they're going to shoot me because of that other man's fucking mistakes? No, no. We're gonna shoot him. Oh, I know they won't. I tried to tell them, uh, Nez. I, tr I did. Yeah, I have nothing to do with this. Don't you get it yet, you idiot? It's time to kill people, Eddie. Wake the fuck up. Uh, really? Yeah, do that. And then I remembered I still had my gun. Those guys were stupid. Uh, 